Okay, welcome back to FTL. Today we are going to be playing through with the slug type B ship, the Stormwalker. Uh, I haven't actually used this ship before. I think maybe I played through the game once with it, but I am super unfamiliar with it. So this will be an interesting run. Uh, we can see it comes with a healing burst and a missile launcher. And it comes pre-equipped with a teleporter, presumably to take advantage of that healing burst. Um, we'll see how this goes. Let's rename it. There we go. That's what it looks like to me. So we'll go with that. Alright. Since the ship seems to be optimized for boarding actions, that is what I'll be using it for, at least to start out with. The store up there, but I've got no cash, so... Let's see if we can dislodge this ship. Yeah. system. Finally, we come across a hostile ship. Alright. So, basically my plan here is to spend a couple missiles, one to disable their drone control and one to disable their weapons. And by the time I do that, the healing burst should be charged and I'll be able to send my guys over. In fact, there's really no reason to disable their weapons at all now that I look at their armament. So I'm just going to worry about taking out their drones. Alright, that hit, so it is time to send over my boarding party. to see if the healing burst can miss like other bomb weapons. That would be potentially very bad if it's true, but I haven't used it enough to know. Alright, so to use it, same as any other bomb weapon, you just target it on the room you want to hit. It heals up your guys. And thanks to that, they'll be able to take out their crew without any risk. so bad. We get a decent reward. Oh, I see. The other gimmick of this ship is that you do not start with a med bay. So this healing burst is the only way to heal your crew until presumably you buy one. Get some free fuel from that asteroid field. find ourselves in an asteroid field. Now this should be a fairly easy fight, although I am concerned about stray asteroids given that we only have one layer of shield. I am going to go ahead and target their weapons bay because they'll be able to hit me with that uh, <coughs> basic beam weapon they've got. Okay, with that out of commission, it's time to send over our guys. And my healing burst is all queued up, so if and when they get too low on health, I'll be able to fix them up. There we go. It's still going to be a fairly close fight, just because slug aren't really any better at combat than humans. But... It's not too much of a risk. Hopefully the reward will make it worthwhile. Hey, we got a nice weapon for that, so that was definitely worth our time. Alright, let's get out of here.
Now, because we have slug crew, we can attempt to communicate telepathically with these strange alien creatures. And because of that, we get a free Angie crew member. It's very nice. Now we have somebody to man our weapons bay. Oh, I should probably give the ship a once-over and make sure there aren't any fires burning somewhere that I haven't seen. It's got all these empty rooms back here because, oh yeah, there must be a hull breach somewhere. Or not. I'm just imagining things. Huh. Okay. Whatever. For some, re for some reason, this room was, it was without oxygen for a split second. I don't know why. But our ship seems to be in good order, so let's move on. We will be fighting this mercenary ship. I think in this case it's probably worth spending two missiles, one to take out their weapons bay and the second to hopefully injure their crew. Uh, this is a rock ship so it could have rock crewmen on board which would be a bit more than my current crew is equipped to handle. Uh, and they've damaged my engine room but not enough that it matters. Let's see what they've got on board. Oh, they've got a Mantis. This is going to be a close fight. I'm going to have to make use of that healing burst much sooner than I had hoped. Such as right now. Ooh, that was right down to the wire. And in fact, we may not win this fight anyway. Thankfully, my uh, teleporter should be recharged by the time I have to bring them home. Yeah. Basically what I'm going to have to do is take my time with this fight, bring my guys back, spend another bomb to heal them up, send them back on board to finish it up. Not having a med bay I suppose is fair from a balance perspective, but it does make using the ship the way it was intended rather annoying. But that's probably just because I'm so used to the Manus Type B and it's utterly broken boarding abilities. There we go. Not even a particularly good reward there, but I'll take what I can get. I was really hoping to find another store in this sector before I had to leave it, but it looks like that may not be in the cards. And here we have an automated ship. Thankfully we have enough missiles that I don't feel too bad about using a bunch of ammo to take this guy out. Right in the engine. There we go, weapons down. Now if I can take out their shields, I can probably sit back and let the asteroid field do the rest of the work for me. So I'm just going to do that. It may take a while because the asteroids do seem to come in somewhat randomized waves. But there's one. And there's another. Yeah, I was right. No stores. Well, that's okay. Ooh, slavers. We can definitely take these guys off. Same deal as before. I'm just going to disable their weapons and then go in once my healing burst is charged. Oh, wow. That was... Pretty easy. I'm actually gonna skip the fight and accept their offer. We get a Rockman out of it. That's very nice. He will make a better border than one of our slugs. 
let's see. Yeah, the second slug does not have a lot of combat experience, so I'm just going to put him on engine room duty. And let's get out of this sector. Automated ship. We can handle this. Again, I really don't get this weapon combo of ion weapon and missile launcher. It just seems redundant to me. Well, no, no, not redundant, but mutually inco incompatible. One more ought to do it. Four missiles is a bit of a steep price to pay for one assault drone, so hopefully the reward will be worth it. Nope, nothing there. Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Let's move on to the next sector. I'm going to go to this pirate-controlled sector because that offers a less hostile path through the overall map. And we have a store right here. That's very good news. Alright. I'm really tempted to buy cloaking, but I need a medbay much more than I need cloak right now. Really use some more weapons too, but I'll have to be content with what I have for the time being. I think it's also time to upgrade our shields. While I'm at it, I'm gonna send our injured crew over to heal up. confident about being able to simply board these guys straight away. I am going to do a little power juggling so I can get that second layer of shields up, because that'll be very handy in this asteroid field. No, I should play it safe and at least wait for my healing burst to charge before I send them over. I'm not worried about losing the Rockman, but I could lose this slug and that would be a real shame. hits there, that's surprising. I love this particular background music track, it's very nice. Alright, healing burst is all charged up, it's time to go board these guys. Oh, and that was a good idea because those are two mantis, so it's going to be a rough fight, especially for my slug man. Get over there in time. Woo, just barely. Okay. Take a few more parting shots from the ship. At least now we don't have to spend bombs to top off our crew's health after a fight. scrap into some more reactor upgrades as soon as I can. Hey, more slavers. Alright, I'm gonna have to do this fight with just one level of shielding just so I can get these guys healed up and deal with their weapons. Weapons are out. This 
should be a fairly easy fight. They're not even sending in both crew members to deal with me at once, so... In this case, if my slugman gets too low, I'm just gonna have him flee and let the rock guys duke it out on their own. Oh. Oh dear. Get out of there. No! Stop fighting my slug! Alright. I'm gonna queue up a healing burst and then send my slugman in there and hopefully the timing will work out. Nope. Didn't make it. Well, that's what I was afraid of. Well, hey, that was a fair trade, actually. We got a Mantis in exchange for our slug. I will take that. And let's buy some reactor upgrades, because oh boy, do we need them. There we go. Free stuff from an asteroid field. And we can send in a rock crew member to put out a fire. Oh, and we get a lot of scrap and a scrap recovery arm. That is a delightful reward. And an ion storm. Well, let's search it, and by searching it we get another crew member. Good news. It's a human, so he's going to be on shield duty. Looks like we've been boarded. They're probably going to head straight for the shield room, so I'm going to send my guys down there. Yeah, I was right. They're all humans, though, so this shouldn't be too difficult of a fight for my crew. Especially since we have them outnumbered. This will be some valuable combat experience for that new Mantis I just brought on board as well. Excellent. I'm just going to wait for my crew to heal up before I make this jump. Okay. Now you can see there are three enemy crew in this room, but only two of them were fighting because one of them was actually just trying to break through the door. A human crew member should be able to take care of it. This is the downside of slug ships. I do not know where fire on board that ship is until I send a slug into an adjacent room. Clearly somewhere, I just don't know where. I should jump away now before I take any more damage. Okay, we finally get some energy weapons. That's good. since I've got a decent boarding crew and a med bay, and I would much rather have that hull laser. i really got to figure out where that fire on my ship is. Oh, there it is. Okay. I'm going to send in my rock man to deal with that.
There we go. That took a little while, but... No big deal. Yeah, the layout of this slug ship is kind of funky because you've just got this one little hallway here that connects the forward part of the ship to the rear. got all these empty rooms back here that I don't really see the purpose of. Another day, another Mantis scout ship. <laughs> another crew member, but there's not really much point. I'm doing okay on the crew right now. Okay, let's see if we can hijack the ship. We will have to take out their engines. It's going to take a little bit of time for my guys to get back to the teleporter. that missile launcher while I deal with their crew. Looks like we're not going anywhere either. Let's keep an eye on my mantis's health here. Okay. I'm just gonna send in my Rockman to deal with this guy. Hopefully, yeah, okay. It was a close fight, but we were able to pull it off, and we got a decent reward from it. time to get out of this sector and it's also time to cut off this video so I will catch you guys next time